Hello, welcome back. Today I have got an exciting news for all of you guys, especially for someone who wants to jailbreak their iPhone on iOS 13. And finally, CheckRun has been released for Linux version. Today I'm gonna show you how you can run CheckRun directly on Linux without installing it. So you don't need to install Linux in order to run CheckRun. So you just run Linux directly from the USB hard drive. So all you have to do, you need to download um, Ubuntu file and then you need to download this um, create bootable USB and you need to download the software after that you can plug in your USB into your computer and after that you need to um, run the software and you can run it as administrator and then it will recognize your USB and have the 16GB USB and then you can select the ISO so I'm gonna go to this or ISO image and then you can hit on select and then you need to choose the Ubuntu file for me it is on desktop I can select Ubuntu 19 here and then I can click on open and after that all of these options I'm gonna leave it at default and all, all you have to do just click on start and it will begin to create bootable USB and for me I don't have to do that I just um, I have already did it so I'm gonna restart the computer And when you are restart, you need to press on any key in order to go to BIO. So you can boot it into your USB. So for my PC, I need to press on F12. And then it will go into boot device option, as you can see. And then you can use arrow down to go to uh, my USB, this one. And then you can click on enter. And then it will boot into Ubuntu. The good thing about this Ubuntu version, as you can see, you can try Ubuntu without installing. So it it's means that you don't need to install Ubuntu in order to run it. So you can, so it doesn't affect your hard drive or it doesn't affect the data on your computer. And then you can hit on enter. Alright, now you are running on Ubuntu desktop. So first of all, you need to download CheckRun. And so you can go to Firefox browser and make sure your computer is connected to the internet. And for me, in order to connect to the internet, I just plug in my phone and I can share it through personal hotspot, through the USB. And for this version of um, Ubuntu, um, we just try it so it doesn't support the Wi-Fi so it makes sure you connect your iPhone and send it through personal hotspot and after that you can open the browser and you can go to Linux and you can download for Linux 86 and 64 bit as you can see here and after download you will see um, check on download folder here and then you can right click and move it to desktop so move it to and then you need to select on desktop and click on select and now your file your check and file will move to the desktop as you can see and now you need to open up terminal after you open up terminal you need to copy the um, command one by one into terminal so you can copy this one
All right, after you run all of those commands, you can now open check then and you can type the following command that I type so you can follow it carefully. And after that, you will see check and pop up on the screen so you can connect your phone to your computer. And if you see trust, make sure you hit on trust, otherwise it doesn't recognize your phone. So make sure you click on trust. And then it will be recognized. In order to control check and on um, Linux, you need to use arrow, arrow key so you can use arrow left or right to move the button so it, does, it doesn't work on uh, mouse because we are using command so on option um, I will leave it at default but if you are on other version you can check allow untrust iOS version so for me I'm gonna leave it at default I can go back and then I can um, start by hit on enter and now I can enter my phone in recovery mode Now the phone is in recovery mode as you can see and now you can start. And now we have successfully jailbreak the iPhone. So now you can go to your screen and you will see check an icon on the home screen. As you can see, and now you can open up check ran, and then you will be able to install side here. And finally, thanks for watching and I hope you like this video. And if you have any question, you can comment down below.